Blind vs blind battles happen often when playing short-handed. The small blind and the big blind are the most difficult positions to play in No Limit Hold'em because you are playing in pots out of position. Limping from the small blind is bad. You should be raising with any two cards if the big blind is a weak type player and only raising good hands if the big blind is defending their blinds and 3-betting you often. Playing in a big blind is a lot like playing on the button because you are last to act in the hand. Now although you should be uh, raising the big blind when the small blind ha happens to limp in, this hand is a good example of why it can be a good, good idea to be um, deceptive uh, when you have an ace in the big blind and they just limp in. When they limp in you, can, you should actually take a note that they're, they're actually a weak type player because limping in from the small blind is a really bad play. Now when they happen to bet the flop, they're, they're probably doing that with any two cards as I said. Uh, so the ace high is looking good at this point, so I call the flop bet. The turn goes check check. And the river is also checked. And I take down the pot with ace high. 